Thanks for joining us today to learn all about the Quiet Warmth Radiant Film Heating Systems for tile and floating floors, along with our joist retrofit option for under existing floors. Quiet Warmth Floor Heating Systems are different from other electric in-floor heating systems because Quiet Warmth uses a conductive ink technology instead of a heating cable. This unique technology provides a more even distribution of heat to the floors with no cold spots and no danger to floor covering materials in concerns to overheating. The conductive ink strips in each stripe is designed to not exceed 85 degrees Fahrenheit. So at the most, the system will tap itself out at 85 degrees. Now, generally speaking, most people from what we have found live within their own room temperatures and comfort levels, which is somewhere between 72 and 75 degrees. The quiet warmth thermostats will allow controlling the system to personal comfort. In traditional electric radiant heat systems that weave a heating cable, the use of self-levelers are needed to bury the cable system so that the subfloor is flat for the floor covering installation. The quiet warmth systems are thinner than a credit card and will not raise the floor height. And additionally, the quiet warmth system does not require any additional self-levelers, which saves both time and money. It installs right beneath your flooring surface. Just unroll and go. Quite literally, using the quiet warmth system can save days on installation by not needing to wait for extra steps in between, like drying times and curing of setting materials for the heating system. Oh, but what happens if your guest already installed their floor or has a floor they don't want replaced? Eh, no problem. Quiet Warmth has an under subfloor option available so you can retrofit between joist spacing beneath an available access to a subfloor like in a basement or a crawl space. This thin technology is made for warm feet, fast installation, and the weekend warrior. Each one of these black stripes in the heating mat is its own heater. So even if one of these bars becomes damaged, perhaps by an unknown factor during installation, for example, it doesn't stop the rest of the mat from working. Only the bar that's damaged will no longer work. And because each stripe is independent, each mat can be cut to length only without destroying the function of the mat. Now this allows you to customize mats to your room size. And finally, while you can cover the entire room with floor heat with quiet warmth mats, it isn't always needed. Since quiet warmth is so thin and doesn't raise the subfloor height, you can strategically place the mats where you spend the most time to enjoy specific comfort. And this will save time and money by not having to cover the entire room with floor heat. And we call this spot heating. An example is a bathroom. Place a mat in front of the vanity where it's common to spend a large part of your mornings getting ready. With a second mat, place it in front of the shower or tub so that your feet are warm upon entering or exiting the bath. So instead of covering the entire bathroom, cover where the heat will be used the most. Being able to place the heat where you would enjoy the comfort helps the guests to customize their own home experience. 